Weekly market numbers, May 5th, 2022, Hoboken, Jersey City. This is Brian Murray, and let's take a look at the numbers. So, for Hoboken and Jersey City, you can see that the interest rates or the rate hikes have made a small impact on the market. You still look at the under contracts versus available, and it's about one and a half months in Hoboken and a little over two months in Jersey City. That means that the market slowed a drop not much more than a drop. If you look at the number of new listings in the last 30 days, 100 in Hoboken, 89 in Jersey City. That's still not a lot of, of new listings that have come on the market for the spring market. The challenge is that nobody has a place to live. That it's not about the interest rates rising, it's about you can't find a home in the suburbs and if they think that this spring is going to be any different than last spring or the spring before you are mistaken so you're going to see this giant giant squeeze in the suburbs you know over the last two years to three years a lot of homes have sold in those suburbs so people have kind of locked in they've taken up all the excess inventory and that's a trickle down effect Moreover, more buyers want two and three bedrooms and more space to work from home. So that is causing the larger home market to really be competitive. That's what you see here. Ask to sold price over 100% in Hoboken, almost 100% in Jersey City. That means lots and lots of bidding wars. If you need to find a home and you haven't been able to find a home, you need to come here first and talk to me. I have strategies for my clients for multiple bid situations, i.e. bidding wars. I also know how to get sellers to their next home so they have a safe landing spot. So if you're thinking of selling and you don't want to sell because you don't know where you're going to get a home, come talk to me. I have many, many connections throughout the burbs and the fact is that the only way homes are getting sold in the burbs are in these who you know situations. It's the truth. I had a realtor the other day tell me in the burbs that the way he sells homes is he horse trades them with other agents. When there's 40 offers out there on a home or 20 offers or 15 offers on a home, it's like, well, you get me this one and I'll give you my next one. Wish it weren't the case. Wish it wasn't like that. The seller still gets the most amount of money and now it's just picking from which lucky buyer gets the home. So come to me because I know the realtors that have the homes and then we can get your home sold for the highest price. This is the weekly market report, Hoboken, Jersey City, May 5th, 2022.